The agricultural sector is a hugely isolated sector, it's very traditional and it's male dominated and unfortunately men are 75% more likely to commit suicide than women. So we provide support to those in the agricultural sector in a few different ways. We provide um, fully funded counselling to those in the sector so they're getting support with their mental health but we also provide mental health first aid training as well for those people who work within the sector. In July 2016, um, unfortunately, my husband committed suicide. Uh, he um, had suffered with mental health problems for several years and everything got too much for him. Um, following his death, I realised that there was a real lack of support available for those in the agricultural sector in particular, so decided to do something about it and set up the DPJ Foundation. I'm a volunteer myself, so I speak to people on the phones and, you know, when you hear kind of how desperate they are and how grateful they are to have support, it's just... I can't put it into words how good that feels to be able to know that you're there for them. I've been my own and Pragoro. My word is about dinner and a sector of Methodol. And I started a show on Methodol as a Benro and Hulfor. Dath, couple mounty, a part better DPJ, a word of the gore of the knee. Her blow am down the Savadliad, but the very thin and bill, heavy. I could hunt her nod of Poeris. The charity has grown immensely since we set up in July 2016. We're now a registered charity. We've got 18 volunteers. We cover majority of South and West Wales and the farming communities that are there and we're working our way up North Wales as well. I feel really happy that we've been nominated for uh, St David's Awards. I'm a proud Welsh woman through and through and so to be recognised in Wales by you know, the Welsh Government is just is amazing and to be able to put the agricultural sector in the forefront of people's minds I think is really important for me so no, I'm very grateful.